Emmy nominations for her amazing role as Coach Beast on Glee oh, that we loved so much. She was so good in that role. Yeah, she was. And more recently, she was really good in another role. She received all of our accolades and our love for the role of officiant for marrying <laughs> you, Mark Steinitz, and now Julie Steinitz. Please welcome back to our home. A fit wedding officiant, actress, and just all around awesome lady, Dot Thank Marie you. Jones. Thank you so much. Love you. Thank you. I love you guys too. So I love you because during that she was holding Julie's arm so she couldn't run away. That's why I wanted to have her there. She was like, let me go, I gotta get out of here, I can't do this. Um, that is no. so not true. <laughs> a little bit. Um, let, let me ask, <laughs> and that's why I love you. Uh, favorite, um, yeah, uh, favorite memory of the year for you? It, it'd have to be, and I'm not just saying that because I'm here, but um, why you gotta make me wanna cry, Mark? <laughs> just being there for you because yeah. I've known you for so many years and I think the world of you. And I love Julie and, and Norbert, of course, and, and Fred and <laughs> the boys. The boy, yeah. It's like just overwhelming. And to think that I got to do that for you. You brought so much to that. You know, you really did, did, right? A lot of edits. You made me feel so at ease and just I know. wonderful. You, Julie, were you excited when she said she would? I was so, I think I screamed and I don't do that. <laughs> <laughs> I'm so happy. Oh, yeah. sweetheart. Well, you can do it again next week if you want. <laughs> <laughs> we'll renew your vows. Yeah, yeah. 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 I'm I'm there. It's not ever too early. Oh. It was a really fun party. Let's it really was a great time. <laughs> it's so fun. And you know what? Oh, it, it starts <laughs> with you because you really set the tone, didn't you, as the efficient, efficient. <laughs> you, you and Mark, your friendship, like we said earlier, goes back way back. This is like yeah. going on a decade now. You really are like brother and sister. Yeah. Yeah. But how did how did this happen where you became the officiant for the wedding? Um, actually, my wife, Bridget, said, um, <laughs> you need to text Mark right away. And I'm like, what's wrong? I thought, oh my God. Oh. And she said, he and, he and Julia are engaged. And I'm like, oh my God. So I'm like, congratulations. I forget exactly what I said, but like my brother, I said, I'm so happy for you. And I said, and by the way, if you need someone to marry you, I'm ordained and I would be honored. And he wrote back like, are you kidding me? They're like, wow. Well, I took the text and I went to Julie and I said, look at this, look at that, because I got the text mm -hmm. and she screamed. Okay. The second time. It's the second time she screamed. Uh, no, but very excited for it. And I just was like, are you kidding me? It Absolutely. just was so perfect. You know, I, I didn't really think of you in that in that role. And, and I also said, please don't feel any pressure if you already have yeah. somebody. It's just know that I think the world of you. I know I, it was it was it was it was so perfect it because was perfect. because Dot has this amazing compassion and we talked about the work that you've done early in your career and working with youth and whatnot. She has a heart of gold, um, and and I we told her we said whatever she's like. What do you want me to say? So we actually <laughs> FaceTimed with you mm -hmm. to just sort of connect and get together, and we chatted and we we're like, whatever you want to say, whatever do you, you want to do. <laughs> no, 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 no. As a matter of fact, it was lovely. It was such a touching moment, and you did put some comedy in there which really made it even better you want to see it Have yeah, you seen yeah, it? yeah. No. do you remember what you said kind of sort of not <laughs> All right, let's take a look dearly beloved distinguished guests friends family crashers <laughs> we are here to witness this amazing union between mark and julie i couldn't be more happy for you and for you because you're getting a hell of a guy Without further ado, you ready? I've been ready a long time. Okay. <laughs> I think you need to kiss the bride. With the power invested in me through the state of California, we only got about 15 minutes left on this license. So, um, <laughs> I wish you all the love in the world. And ladies and gentlemen, I now pronounce you man and wife. You may kiss your bride. Yeah, baby! Yeah, baby. <laughs> She said you could kiss the bride, and I don't know, did anyone notice? Can we watch this back for a moment? <laughs> oh no, what did I do now? What? <laughs> <laughs> oh, well, I know! I, did you I, marry I, Don Marie Jones? Or that, it was really a double wedding. Yes. Yeah. Well, I, I felt, no, it was- It's an LA yeah, wedding. Yeah, uh -huh. <laughs> yeah. Right. 
<laughs> it was the it was the humor you brought because Julie was we were both nervous yeah. and it was yeah. you just cut through all of that with your humor and and just being so real and that's what you do that with your acting as well but it was so wonderful. were you shocked Julie when she said you may kiss the bride and he leaned in <laughs> I, I didn't even re I didn't even until just now, just I'm now. Clean. Oh, yeah. <laughs> So this isn't we ours was a surprise wedding. I understand yeah. that's not too far of a throw from yours. No, um, actually, it'll be three years this December twenty first. Um, Bridget and I had a Christmas party, and we told all of our friends that you know our chosen family, and that were here, and we told them it was an ugly Christmas sweater party. Oh. So, oh. Yeah. so everybody oh. back to the house. Oh my God. Oh, I made that. You did not. You made that. would never, never have Because how many Santas That's have a patch? That is an awesome. eye patch. <laughs> oh and um, it Charisma. was hilarious. And so we had everybody over, and um, our friend <laughs> uh, Brian, who's a publicist, he said, Dot and Bridget have something special for you guys. We had the whole backyard lit up and caters and everything outside and chairs all set up and we got married in our backyard. Aww. Aww. It's a great, it brings such great energy to the whole, yeah, the whole event. Yeah. And I uh, feel like it really blesses the house in a way, you know, because it really fills it with love when you yeah. share something yeah. like that. Oh yeah. <laughs> now Mark and Julie, yeah. they had their, their little babies involved. Little Fred Robert, and Norbert Fred and were totally involved in the wedding. <laughs> did you have your little, did you have your babies involved as well? No, we didn't have uh, Brett and Jovi then. Oh, you didn't. We have no. pot belly pigs now. We have three cats, yeah. but they were. <laughs> wow. Oh, Lord him. And there were babies there, right? That's Brett and Jovi. Now that's when they were the size of a loaf of bread. Now they're the size of a bread truck. Uh -huh. <laughs> they're like 165 pounds now. Each? I, yeah. One bread, one tomato? Oh, oh no. that's bread. Oh. Hey, tomato. He has a leopard pillow. I love oh. it. That's a blanket. I, I love it. Oh, oh my gosh. And I, oh, he oh, had shoulder change. elbow surgery in January, so he's still milking it. But you, um, still milking <laughs> but they're very smart, aren't they? Yes. They're extremely smart. Well, oh my, God, oh my really gosh, that's like so cute. And they live in your house. They live in the house and they're potty trained to go in the backyard to go to the bathroom. And <laughs> They're actually smarter than dogs, some people say. Yes, they are. So listen, with that in mind, yeah, you know how much Norbert. we love our pets. Mm -hmm. We know how much you love your pets. We, mm -hmm. um, we, have a, we still have to show our gratitude. And Julie, would you mind sharing with Dot what your mom is providing? Yeah, sure. So we wanted to give you something unique and special. And so she created a digital illustration of your babies and what? Um, there's oh, a picture of it there. Um, so she's sending that to you and also um, Oh my god, that's and, beautiful. And also a set of mugs with the illustration on them as oh. well. So Did they have, oh we my have the god. Oh, yeah. oh, so there's three mugs, one for all of you. One for so. Savannah. And her yeah, mom absolutely. is a her mom is an amazing artist and does all the artist artwork for her book. That's, that's so what they yeah. sound like? Yeah. Is that bread or joke? <laughs> <laughs> that's or so Matt. Sweet. Yes. Or it might be Matt Rogers. <laughs> that is her look for God, by the way. Oh 